In one of my other videos I've already told you about the occult around James Bond, but I haven't told you about his author, Sir Ian Fleming, yet. He was a Sir and member of the aristocracy by birth, where the word Sir is from Sire, meaning a king, which is from the pharaonic Sar, like in a Sar, coffages, which is a box to put the pharaoh in when he is dead, or in C. Sar, the king of Rome, Nebuchadnezzar, the king of Babylon, etc., or the Win Sar family, or the Tsars. See my video, The Pharaoh Show. And here you can see the occult here, you know, this is Commander Fleming, an aristocrat. And here, what is this, the Brotherhood of the Snake. And the, uh, the, uh, the, Afri the African or Egyptian Cobra is the symbol of the Pharaonic Dignity. I don't know what it is, it says an S here and an I. It's all occult. His mother was Evelyn Saint Croix Rose, which is a Templar's name from Octogon, where a rose is red and croix is the French word for a cross. So Saint Croix Rose or Saint Croix Rose, also known as the Order of the Rosicrucian, means the Holy Red Cross, as of the Templars and their base Octagon, Switzerland. So no wonder he rose that quick to the rank of commander in the naval intelligence during the war, as he was already born into a Templar's family of Octogon Saint Croix Rose. So here you can see it. Ian Fleming, his mother was Evelyn Saint Croix Rose. This is very important. It's the aristocracy, you know. So this is in uh, Wikipedia. I showed the whole thing to you. So this is about Ian Fleming on Wikipedia. It says birth and family Saint Croix Rose. Templars. And, uh, the obelisk. Ian Fleming's grave memorial at Sevenhampton, the oval, the joining, the four elements, it's all there, pharaohs. In 1929 and 1930 Fleming studied in Geneva, Switzerland, the same year as the Prince of Darkness, Bernhard, also studied in Switzerland, but in Lausanne, just next to each other. And yes, they knew each other and were friends. The prince was that Bond guy with the fast cars, and it was here in Switzerland at some aristocratic gathering in some castle they met, an ar aristocrat of the von Bismarck family called, called Ulrich Wille, a Swiss general who had been financing Adolf Hitler from 1922 onwards as Rudolf Hess studied in Zurich and brought Hitler to Switzerland. Well, I already told you this in my other videos. Fleming, while in Switzerland, had this aristocratic girlfriend, Monique Banchot de Bottome, who introduced him to the Zurich-based Hitler finances and Swiss general Ulrich Wille of the von Bismarck family. And she was a member of the Thule organization with ties to Alistair Crowley, who also came and lived in Nazi Germany in 1930, together with Fleming and that Prince of Darkness. They were all together there. Fleming's grandfather, by the way, was a very rich banker, and he founded the Scottish American Investment Trust and the bank Robert Fleming and Company. Uh, later on we come back to it when uh, he created James Bond out of uh, Scotland and Switzerland. And it also says here that he went, uh, Fleming he went to the Munich University where Mr. Hitler was and the Prince of Darkness. They all were there. 
And because Hitler was in Munich at the time, both the prince and Fleming decided to go to Munich too, and sort of studied at the university there. Being also the exact ti same time the rise of Adolf Hitler started, from 1929 to, to 1934. Here you can see it. The prince, he, started, he, he studied in Lausanne, Berlin and Munich from 1929 on. Yeah, this is about the prince of darkness. And therefore Fleming could live in the apartment of Sir Oswald Mosley, an aristocrat and the leader of the British Fascist Party at 22B Abbey Street, Belgravia, London from 1934 till 1945 where the English aristocratic sisters Unity and Diana Mitford were also in the game and it was Fleming and the Prince bringing the money to Hitler in Munich for his election campaign from Switzerland and the Swiss general really leading to the rise of Hitler it was a war of the aristocracy and Switzerland of the Templars against the Europeans, Russians, Jews and even against the Germans. And this is the true reason that Fleming came up with special forces and assault unit Commando 30 to finally get their man Hitler out by the end of the war, bringing Hitler to the other end of the world where the prince owned vast pieces of land. After the war, Fleming felt the need to talk, but he was not allowed to reveal the secret, so he encoded the James Bond novels. They were never really based upon the, uh, upon the name of some or ornithologist or bird watcher. J.A. James stands for Yachin, and B.O. Bond stands for Boaz. The two obelisks of a Freemason temple, just as J.A. Jason, B.O. born. So Jebo is the son Freemasonry and his father is Andrew Bond from Glencoe of the Scottish Rite and where the Templars hid their mighty fleet from the French King Philippe le Bel and from the Catholic Church. This Templars fleet later on used to bring the black slaves to the US Confederate States and his mother is Monique de la Croix from Switzerland and de la Croix means of the cross referring to Switzerland and the sisters of Isis living under the Swiss Templars cross so the son Freemasonry came out of a marriage between the Scottish Rite and Switzerland this trinity is also IHS Isis Horus and Seth most certainly if you look at Jabo's coat of arms with the Holy Trinity and Templars V. 007 is the number of the pyramid, seven that is, who these aristocratic Templars really are. Seven is three plus four, three for a pyramid side standing for IHS and four for its base and the four elements. Only this is why seven is a holy number in the old books. And in the novels, James Bond really does have a coat of arms here with the Templars V and the three points of this marriage of uh, Andrew bon Bond, the father of James Bond, and his Swiss mother, Monique de la Croix, just like Fleming, Fleming his mother and his own family of uh, Saint Croix Rose. And the, um, uh, the slogan of, of their coat of arms is Orbis non suffisit. That means the world is not enough. You know, the James Bond, the world is not enough. Well, they always show in the movie with those, with the song. And after their success of World War II, after the war, the New World Order could really start. So what better way to announce that to all the initiates worldwide than by using a bestseller or blockbuster film? I remember well how D Diana was entirely disillusioned after they tried to initiate her into all that. It was like a world of dreams broke together. So Bond 007 is in fact a bond or alliance between Octogon and the Scottish Rite, the fleet and the money base. This is why James Bond also went to school in Geneva of the motherland 
just as Fleming and then became a commander of the fleet in the Royal Navy because Bond is a bond and union between the Scottish Naval Templars and the Swiss Money Templars. We are being lied to by our pharaonic masters of the aristocracy who still have all the power now in the New World Order pushing us into entire world wars, genocides and mass slaughter and always their base Switzerland, their head of the conglomerate where all the money is. All secret services are against mankind and not against some other intelligence service. They all work together for the pharaohocracy with very evil men like this pharaoh Sir Sire Sar, Ian Fleming, his mother Saint Croix Rose, Rosicrucian, from that evil Swiss bloodline from Octogon in the Alps. And you can see it, Sir Oswald Mosley. They're all aristocrats. You know, that's why Fleming was living in his house for about 15 years. So this is in Wikipedia. They all knew each other. Hitler, Fleming, Mosley, the Prince of Darkness, Switzerland, Ulrich Wille. They all knew each other. It says... In April 1930, Alistair Crowley, he moved to Berlin. Exactly the same time when the Prince of Darkness, Bernhard, Ian Fleming, uh, they were all there, you know, complotting, conspiring, plotting against, against the world. So this is in Wikipedia. Nice fella, isn't it? And here it is about the this in German, but uh, it's about the the Prince of Darkness, Bernhard, how he was writing letters to Mr. Hitler. Uh, they found some letters even they they wrote together. There he is, a friend of Ian Fleming. All conspiring together, they were all in Munich and Berlin. <laughs> And it comes all from here, the base, where they keep their money, where they go and study, where they financed Adolf Hitler, where the Prince of Darkness studied, where Fleming studied, just before going to Nazi Germany and then to England, back to England. It all started here. Switzerland is the base.